Fellow sitters, stand. Your call, lift your heart, relax your shoulders and your jaw, and three breaths from your belly and in and out through your nose. Fantastic. All right, let's go. Warm up. Put your hands out front and we're just gonna roll your wrists here. And again, you could be seated or standing for the first little bit here. Work your own pace, right? Roll the other way. So keep those arms extended. Wiggle your fingers. Nice. Flex your wrists. Roll those hands again and out to the side and watch what's around you. Perfect. Extend your fingers out. And you're going to tilt your arms. And back to center again. Other side. Again, perfect. Back to center again. <laughs> Excellent. Bring your arms down. Toe tap straight down. Add some bicep curls here. Excellent. Little hip twist in. Keep your hands the same. Perfect. Back to your rolling march again. Shake your arms out. Perfect. Shoulders. Inhale them up. Exhale them down. Again, just follow your breath. One more. Excellent. Shoulders come back. Tuck your elbows in. Hands out to the side. Hands up. Flex at the top. And flex at the bottom. Some nice, easy, easy breaths from your belly and into your nose. Two more. And one. Fantastic. Turn it down. Shake that out. Perfect. Nice and easy. Make sure your head's over your heart. Drop an ear over to shoulder. Excellent. And don't force it. Wherever it goes, where it goes. Excellent. Bring your head back up to center. And then other side. Again, relax your shoulders. Perfect. And again, back up to center. Nice and easy. Just going to roll with that. Shoulders come back. I'm kind of good with most of that stuff. We're going to move on into the cardio part. And again, work at your own pace no matter what. I'm going to start with the feet. Always seems a good place to start. If you need your chair, use it. Okay. A little toe tap out to the front. Hands. Oh, we'll mess up the hands today. Good. Some little circles with your hands or hand. And again, you know all that stuff, right? So keep your heart lifted. Excellent. Change your arms. Keep your feet with this toe tap to the front. Change your arms around. Excellent. Make those circles a little bit bigger. Excellent. 
Excellent. Perfect. Bring those arms back down. Let them relax again. Keep your toe tap to the front. Add your arms and into a march. Nice. Fantastic. We'll do a little more arm stuff here. So with your arms going to reach out front, grab and pull. Reach, grab, pull. Reach, grab, pull. Nice. One more. Reach, grab, pull. Fantastic. Bring your arms down again. Shake it out. Nice. So we'll do some hamstring curls. Again, you've got your chair for balance, right? Bring your heels up. You're trying to kick yourself. Heels to your hips. Excellent. Hands are going to push forward or hand. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Fantastic. And back down again into your march. Take a breath. Nice. So anytime as you're going through here, take a sip of water whenever you like, right? Next, do some knee ups. As you bring your knees up, you push your hands down. And again, if you're holding on, it's just the one arm that's working. I encourage you to change sides of your chair if you're using that for balance, all right? Just push, lift your knee. Excellent. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Back to your march again. So that count that I'm doing, I'm counting me down, but it's also letting you know when the end is coming, right? So if you don't match those same numbers, it doesn't matter. As long as you're moving, it's good. All right. Bring your feet apart a little bit. A little toe tap here. And those hands in behind. Add a little dip in the middle. Down. Again, you don't have to go far. All right, and push across your chest, release those hands, push, 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 excellent. And you're going to reach up and across, reach. Don't hold your breath. Make sure you're breathing. Excellent. Back across your chest again. Push. Push. Nice. Bring those arms down. And again, grab your wrists. A little dip in between. Fantastic. Release those hands again. Lower back down. Plant your feet. Shift your weight from side to side. A little at a time. Excellent. Back is flat. Hips are set back. Excellent. Add that pot stir. Should I say cauldron? Change direction. Perfect. Nice. 
Fantastic, drop that ladle down, bring yourself back up again. Again, grab your wrists in behind, dip in between. Perfect. Check your posture. Fantastic. Let go of those hands again. This time, we're gonna push across and then we're gonna open up to the outsides, all right? Push, push. Excellent. And open up, out, reach. It can be high, it can be out to the side, doesn't matter. Spread your fingers. Excellent. Perfect. Back across again. Push. Push. Excellent. And a little bit of a rotation here. Opposite hand to side. Perfect. And bring your feet and arms all back together again into a march. Nice and easy. It's a good time to take a drink or a sip. Keep one foot moving if you can. Good. Perfect. <clears throat> so heels are going to go to the front corners. Hands, we're going to add the hands. Push two times low, two times high. Catch the baby and clap. Push, push, up, up. Catch the baby. Push, push, up. Catch the baby, clap, push, push, up, up. Catch the baby, push, push, up, up. Catch the baby, push, push, up, up. Catch the baby, one more, push, push, up, up. Catch the baby, fantastic. Back into your march again. Let your shoulders relax. Nice, easy breath. Add your arms in here for the march. Nice. And toe tap into the back. Excellent. Add these arms out and spread them out a little bit more. Again, if you're holding on, only the one arm is going. Idea is to let those arms go free. Big long arms reach forwards and backwards. Excellent. And bring those arms back in again. Feet back in into your march. To um, stay with your march here, bring your fists up. I'm gonna do some punches. You know, we'll start with our dominant hand, your dominant hand. So punch, punch, hook, and uppercut. Punch, punch, hook, uppercut. Punch, hook, uppercut. Punch, punch, hook, uppercut. Excellent. Eight, seven, hook, up, six, punch, hook, uppercut, five, four, hook, three, hook, 
two. One. Hook. And fantastic. Wiggle your fingers here. Well done. Stay with your march. When you're ready, fist back up. This time, start with your non-dominant hand and continue with the rest. All right. Join in when you're ready. Hook and up. Punch, punch, hook, up. Punch, punch, hook, up. Punch, punch, hook, up. Eight. Seven. Six. Five, keep breathing. Hook and up. Four. Three. Two. And one. Nice. Hook and up. Excellent. Again, just wiggle your fingers here. Nice. Drop those arms down, shake them out. Perfect. So your best sloppy march here. Kind of regain everything again. Lift your heart. Nice easy breaths. I'm gonna do a little bit of a mambo here. Okay. So one leg stays stationary, the other one does the forward and backwards. Okay? So forwards, back. One foot stationary, the other one does the forwards and backwards. Excellent. You can ask your arm, bring your arms into this. Excellent. Perfect. Three more. Two. One. Excellent. Come back into your march again. Switch legs. All right. So the other leg remains stationary. Excellent. The other one does a little bit of board. Add your arms when you're comfy with it. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Excellent, fantastic. Back to your march again. Smooth your fingers, shake your arms out, whatever you need to do. Nice. Have a sip of water if you like. Funny enough, I'm thirsty today. And back into your march when you're ready. All right. So, V step. Again, you can do it behind your chair, beside your chair, whatever you're comfortable with. You're going to lead with your right leg first. All right. As your arm, leg goes, your arm follows. Again, if you're holding on, you know the rules. <laughs> All right. Whenever you're ready, it's out and back. Out. Out. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Excellent. Stay here. Your march. Excellent. Perfect. Other side, leading with your left leg. I assume you led with your right last time. Same motions, all right? And whenever you're ready, out and back. Out, out, 
So. Keep those steps small. Keep it a little bit easier. Or if you want to get into it, bigger steps. Again, work at your level. Five, four, three, two, one. Perfect, right there is good. Nice work. So we're just gonna come into our cool down as we just plowed through that cardio section pretty fast today. So, cool down. Relax your arms. Change your march to a rolling march. Nice, excellent. We'll start at the top, okay? So again, shoulders, shoulder rounds. Roll those shoulders nice and easy. Again, just find what feels good. Try to slow your heart rate down a little bit. Excellent. Change direction. Perfect. And bring your shoulders down to a rest. Come back. Tuck your elbows in, cross your arms in front of your body, palms up, one arm out to the side, and back, other side, and back. And do this a few times here. Be wary of your shoulders. This is moving the shoulders in a kind of an awkward position. It's a good position, but don't push. Just imagine you're serving people cookies. You know, cookies may not be the best thing, but it works. Excellent. Two more. Nice and easy. And one. Excellent. Right there is good. That's excellent too. Bring those arms down. Again, shoulders relax, heart lifted. Perfect. Stay with your rolling march. Nice. Watch what's around you. Arms at the side. Make a fist and flick. Fist, flick. 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 Fist, flick, flick, three, two, one. Nice, bring those arms back down again. Let your shoulders relax. Perfect. Just let them hang as you roll. Perfect. Nice. So down, pick a foot, plant your toe, rock your hip. Switch sides. And switch again. One more time, switch. Perfect. And back to that rolling march one more time. Lifting your heels, perfect. Did we cover everything? We'll do one more here. Tuck your elbows in, bicep curls, both arms together, okay? Bring your arms up, flex to the top, and then all the way down. Bring it up, flex, and release. Up, flex, and release. Fantastic. Three more, two, and one. Bring those arms down. Again, you kind of wiggle your fingers out, flex your wrists. I get you to roll your wrists here, just out from your body a little bit. 
nice change direction. Nice. Stop right there and just wiggle your fingers. Arms a little further. Fingers up. Slint and down. And up. Perfect. Down one more. Excellent. And just relax your shoulders and arms. Shake that out. Perfect. All right. Have a sip of water. We're going to move on to weights. You can sit or stand for weights. Whatever your choice is. It's good. So we're gonna do a bicep curl, only a little bit different today. So normally we do the bicep curl, palms facing forward and up. We're gonna change that. So rotate your hands back, bring your arms up and down. Okay. You'll find that your arms pull out a little bit further, that's okay. For this particular one, that's what, it, that's what we're doing. So make sure your feet are planted, hearts lifted, right? Your arms out and up and back down. Now, nothing should hurt here. If it does, skip this exercise and join in on the next one, all right? You might hear creaking. Creaking is okay as long as it doesn't hurt. No pops and cracks. Crackles, I should say. Excellent. So the, uh, the bend is mostly at your elbows. Your shoulders are pulling out a little bit, but that's fine. They'll do that. Excellent. It's gonna be your 10 repetitions of all of these exercises. And again, work at your own pace. Come down to the last three. Breathe. Two. And one. Excellent. Nose down. Perfect. Back in line with your body. I'm going to get you to step forward with your right leg. Okay. The left hand's going to go on your hip. Okay. We're not going to, oh no, we'll work that one too. What the heck? One left, right foot forward, left foot back. It's going to kind of sink into a little bit. Keep your back flat, tilt a little bit, okay? So you don't want round, you want it flat, okay? Hands just hanging. I'm gonna pull those arms in to your chest and back down again. Bring your arms up. Back down again. Breathe. Check your weight. Make sure it's over the front and the back foot. Nice and even like. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. Bring yourself back up again. And get your lead with your left leg this time. Now this is a harder exercise to do. So if you find it hard to do, set your weights down somewhere on a chair or a table or whatever, and do the exercise without the weights. And get used to the idea of the position you need to be in. All right? The left leg's forward this time. Again, you're crouching down a little bit. Setting your hips down. Front knee is over the ankle. Good. Left leg is where it happens to go for balance, right? Okay, so elbows, I'm gonna turn a little bit more here. Elbows are up, so you wanna keep them like chicken wings. Nice. Keep your back flat. Straighten your arms, and then back in again, okay? 
So you would have known by that first one how much of a strain there would be. Set your weights down if it's too much, but do the exercise, okay? Get used to the idea of that. Exhale away. Exhale. Fantastic. Perfect. Five. Four. You need to skip one. If you're doing weights, do that. Listen to your body. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. Fantastic. Bring those weights back in. Arms down. Perfect. Let your shoulders come back. Take a breath. got for time perfect again lift your heart feet hip width apart soft knees still we'll do um, push back okay soft knees nice exhale as you push back and then in line with your body okay this time your arms are straight push Try not to let them swing, They're pushing back, but then just coming back in line with your body. Nice, excellent. Perfect. Down to the last four. Keep your knees bent. Soft. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. Bring yourself back in. Well done. Very well done. Let's uh, change this up a little bit. Have a seat, but hang on to your weights. Uh, we'll do the leg one first. Take some of the stress off your shoulders. Okay. Heart lifted. And again, sip water all the way through whenever you're, whenever you're thirsty. Just don't wait. Lift your heel quick, and then slowly lower it back down. Okay. Again, the weights are optional. Depends how you feel about that. Halfway. Four. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. Switch sides. Other side will be the same thing. Lift your heel quick and slowly lower it back down. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice. Lower that back down. Excellent. Hang on to your weights. Push yourself back in your chair, okay? Let's go for, um, do another one here. 
go for a lateral lift, seated this time. Okay, so you can push yourself right in the back of your chair, push your feet into the floor, hands down, one arm at a time. Hammer it up, back down, and then the other side. Stop breathing. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Excellent. Perfect. Nice work. I'm going to set those weights, set them off to the side. Have a sip of water if you haven't in a little bit. Nice work. I'm going to get you to stay seated. We'll do some seated strength stuff. In your chair, adjust what you need to. So, all the way back in your chair, nice. Take a breath, excellent. All right, we're gonna do some uh, knee uh, leg lifts. So one leg at a time, straighten that leg out, whatever you need to do. Bring your toe up towards your knee. Push down with this leg. Nice. Push back in your chair. Excellent. Breathe. I'm going to hold this for 20 seconds. We're already halfway there. Nice work. Keep breathing. Nice. Set that leg down nice and easy. Fantastic. Tap it out if you like. I always find it kind of relieves that hip flexor. The other side is going to be the exact same thing. Whenever you're ready, bring that foot out, toe up towards your knee. Breathe. It's halfway. Five more seconds. Excellent. Bring that leg down nice and easy. Perfect. Again, just kind of tap that out. Well done. Just come up a little bit further on your chair. Actually, a little bit further about the midpoint. Perfect. Feet flat on the floor. Heart lifted. Let's go for the uh, seated crunch. Again, your own pace, arms up, and you're going to hinge from your hips. Your back is going to be flat as you exhale forward and inhale back. You don't have to come all the way back. If you do, fantastic. If you don't, that's also fantastic. You don't have to. You should feel your core tighten up. A little stretch when you go forward and your core tightens up as you lean back.
perfect halfway. Three. Two. Keep that back flat. One. Nice. You just come up to center. Move your arms. Okay. Let your shoulders come back. Perfect. Toe drags. Let's go with uh, one at a time here. Toe down, lift your heel, drag that foot back. Forward, switch sides. Toe down, lift your heel, drag the other foot back. Back to center, switch. Switch again. A little bit of friction on there. Heart lifted. Don't look at your toes. Just trust and know that they're doing what they need to do. Excellent. Alternate between sides. We're halfway. Check your posture. Number three. Two. And one. Perfect, fantastic. A few uh, squats. We won't do sit to stand today, we'll do squats instead. So you wanna be uh, about the middle of your chair. Make sure your feet are flat on the floor. And whenever you're ready, I'm gonna do 10. You work at your own pace. Inhale up, and then just into your squat. Don't sit down, back up again. Excellent, and your squat. It can be anywhere in the spectrum from low, low to a little bit higher. You work at your own pace, right? Inhale to come up, exhale, sit your hips down. Do your best not to rush these. Nice, slow and steady. Excellent, down to four. Three. Two, and one, excellent, back up, stay standing for a second, nice, we're going to continue right into balance here, bring the chair beside you, adjust what you need to, Actually, I'm going to switch sides here. Have a sip of water. Well done, by the way. All right. We'll do that uh, standing tandem. So beside your chair, grab a hold. One foot, bring your right or outside leg to the front. Heel toe, okay? 
both legs straight. Get your balance between the front and the back leg. Perfect. Excellent. Once you get that, once you get to that point, bring your arm out. Hang on to that chair. Okay. Lift your heart. Again, get your balance. Perfect. The option is to lift that other hand and again, work your own pace. Excellent. Stay right here. Nice even breaths. Perfect. Let's lower that chair arm down. Put in the other arm. Perfect. Bring that leg back out. Shake that out. Perfect. Uh, let's go with um, step to the side. So again, you can hang on to your chair. I'm going to get you to step out to the side as far as you can. Well, comfortably. And then push yourself back in. Okay. The holding on to your chair is optional. the side and push yourself back up one more time to the side push yourself back up nice up to that far corner to the side and again push yourself back and again if you're holding on you're just not going as far but you're still pushing through the floor to bring yourself back okay push nice Push. One more. And push yourself back. Nice. Uh, other side of your chair. You just. And again, holding onto your chair, that outside leg is going to come in front of the inside leg. Okay. Heel toe. Balance your weight between the front and the back foot. Both should have equal amounts of weight on them. It'll feel funny, feel like you're tilting forward a little bit. That's okay. And again, hand on your chair. Outside arm, bring it up. Again, lift your heart. Relax your shoulders and your jaw. Just breathe. Okay. And the option is to take that hand off the chair and bring it up. Woo. We're just going to hold this. Fantastic. That chair arm, bring it back down to the chair. If you lifted it up, then lower the outside arm. Perfect. Leg back. Nice. And we're still going to work with this leg. Again, we started to the side, hold on, step to the side, and then push yourself back up to center. Side, push. And again, holding on to the chair is the first point. And once you're comfy with that, then you can let go of the chair and push yourself back up. Push, excellent, and go to that front corner, out to the front, push yourself back, excellent, push, nice. excellent, right there is good, coming behind your chair, both hands on that chair, nice. okay. bring your feet close together, Hands on the chair, bend one of your legs, and bring the knees in line, okay? So you should look down and you should see your knees both in the same plane, in line with each other. Excellent. And of course, the step up from this is to let go of the chair altogether. Again, work at your own pace. Legs back down. Excellent. Let your legs come back. 
And again, all these holds I'm doing, you do them for as long as you can. Sit your leg down. Don't need to beat yourself up, okay? We're gonna do the other leg. So again, both feet are together. Hands on your chair. Bend the other leg this time. And then bring that knee in line with the other knee. Okay. With this leg out, it throws your balance off a little bit more, which is kind of the point. And again, you can take one hand or both hands off to test your balance, however you feel today. And every day will be different. Excellent. Put your hands back on your chair, and that leg back down. Fantastic. Well done. That's it for the balance part. Just some stretches. Um, to the side of your chair. Doesn't matter, we're gonna do both sides, so it doesn't matter which side you choose. Okay. Let's go with, um, hang on to your chair, outside arm, you're gonna inhale it up. Reach, 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 reach. Nice. Again, hand on the chair is optional. Reach up, pull shoulder girdle, high as you can reach. Excellent. Bring that arm back down again. Nice and easy. Perfect. Let your shoulders come back. Nice. So your inside leg is going to come back and around beside the outside. Okay. Again, hang on to your chair for this one. Straighten both your legs as best you can. Nice. Easy breaths here. Three breaths if you can get them in. Nice and easy. Excellent. Hand back on the chair. Front leg goes forward and to the side. Shake that out. Switch sides. Put your feet together. Hand on your chair. Outside arm facing away from you. And inhale that arm up. Just a few breaths here. Perfect. Rotate your hand and bring it back down nice and easy. Excellent. Perfect. Let your shoulders come back. Excellent. Again, the inside leg, the one closest to your chair, is going to go back and around to the outside. Hang on to your chair. Straighten both legs as best you can. Nice. Lift your heart. Head over your heart. Fantastic. Release your legs. That front leg is going to go forward and out to the side. Nice. Shake that out. Perfect. Either behind your chair or beside your call. Bring your feet apart. Into a little squat. Cross your arms. Inhale up. Exhale down. Last one. Perfect. Fantastic. Well done.